wonder if the Savi Maru only costs two. Two Lazlite. Or Lapis. Yeah, I know. It's it's not that I expect anybody to veto my choices. I just don't have any choices. Just like, I mean, like the thing is, is it's sort of like, how to put it? Um, like, like I've said before, like my taste in anime, I'm super picky. So like, I feel like I'm, I'm more in a weird spot compared to like both of you, where it's like I tend to. Oh shit. Like, I don't have as much of a pool of anime I like to pick from, I guess is the gist of it. The majority of my anime, like, honestly, we watched FLCL, and that's like the only thing I'd really want to watch right, right at the moment. Maybe, maybe like Cowboy Bebop, maybe Trigon, but like, it's been a while since I've watched Trigon. I kind of have this low-key feeling that like, uh, the last like, uh, year or two, me and my mom have been like, kind of just doing more stuff together. I think it's just because I've, you know, my social life has been like, kind of baked, so it's like, you know, uh, at this point, you know, just, we hang out a lot, and I have this like, low-key feeling that it's like, at some point, my mom's gonna want to try anime, and I'm kind of feeling like Trigun might be the one that like, might be like, the best go-to. My mom. Because it would have both elements of Western and sci fi. She likes both Western and sci fi. Uh, I think it's, I think it's a, you know, it's a solid anime. Like, it's, it's just really. Trigun's good. So, I mean, what more is there to it? It's not, it's not as, like, emotionally heavy is like Cowboy Bebop either. Yeah, and see that's the thing, like it has the layer of like being serious but also being funny, so it's like that's good because I think the thing is is like if it's just serious, my mom might not be that like into it, and if it's just funny, I also think she might be, might not find it engaging enough. So it, like it's one of those anime that kinda balances it well. Uh, next Saturday is free? Okay, well, I mean, like, give people a heads up, and I guess we can see if something shakes out. Ooh. I don't even know, like, what, <laughs> what there is to do lately, like, it feels really weird because things have been so sparse, so even when, like, things can happen, it's like, what can we even do? Gotcha. I'm not like opposed to things that are like emotionally heavy, but I do really have to be in the mood for it sometimes. Is there like anything on the outside here? There is. Why is there a, a grab point up here? What did that do for me? What the fuck? Holy shit. Okay, what am I looking at here? Okay, okay. We have the demon bell. We have to ring the demon bell. Ooh. Where did this guy come from? Okay, we need the right tool for the job here, which is going to be... Um... <laughs> okay, so we just... <laughs> we just... <laughs> we're walking around, and we ran into... Uh... Oh, whoa. That was gross. Don't do that. Uh, oh jeez, yeah. we gotta take out these guys on the roof first, because there's no way we're taking out that bull just on our own. Oh, ooh. Oh, yep, that, that fucking sucks, ow. Let's see how these go, and that could've been better. Okay, well, surprise, there was a fucking- oh, whoa, you're pinned. There's a fucking bull, uh, 
undead bull monster. Oh. Uh, just in the fucking lake. Ooh. How did I not see those here? Oh. This one adjusts its like angle way more than the other one. Oh, that was a little scary. Fucking pissed. Oh, hey, we got the uh, posture attack. Oh my god. Okay. Beast Karma. Oh, more spirit emblems. That's a good thing. Okay, well, that escalated. <laughs> Let me catch up with the chai here, it's been moving. Um, Tanya the Evil. Well, it wasn't the wrong to choice for you. It might have just been the wrong choice for like the evening in that moment. I, I think, like, here, here's my two cents, what I think. I think it's probably, it's probably fine. It's just one of those things that I think, like, the first couple episodes aren't... Uh... It's like the type of anime you have to watch a few episodes in to really get hooked. Maybe the hook was a little bit more, like, applicable. Like, it grabbed you a little bit more than what it grabbed me or Nikki, but, like, it was... I don't know. I have a hard time, like, getting into anything where, like, the characters are kind of more on the, like, unlikable end. <laughs> it's... I'm not... I mean, like, maybe there is, like, something more, like, that grabs you there that's, like, endearing, but it's, like, I don't know. I... I had a hard time, like, feeling, feeling much, <laughs> feeling much, like, pull me in. <laughs> Devil Man Crybaby is a treat. Devil Man Crybaby is, like, a fucking, like, I mean, that's like doing drugs without drugs. <laughs> it's, like, it's kind of intense. Also, sorry, it keeps, it keeps strolling up and down, so I'm just catching up. So we can have damper in one's social life, Marsha, so just we should move to Charlottetown. Why? Why, why would one want to move to Charlottetown? Just out of curiosity. A shotgun to... Sessions, I'm still not recovered. I think, like... I mean, like, I'm sure, like, the thing with Charlottetown is, like, socially, it's, like... It's a probably a pretty tight-knit place. Like, you get in, you move to Charlottetown, you probably, like, catch up with people quick, and you find people quickly. But her store would have no competition whatsoever. Oh, I see. I assume, I always assumed that Marsha's store was like online mostly. I I mean I don't know all the specifics of it, but like I just I guess it was like the assumption I made was that like she does she like do tables I take it or like I I don't know all I don't know anything. So um lived there for 2 years school. Yeah. And Keed was in PEI for for school there. Um, like I don't know. I've it's been forever since I've been to PEI, but I I remember when I was there, it felt very um, I don't know. It felt very um, not not like maybe I, like cozy, but like 
not quite that. <laughs> she had an online thing for quite a while. Made like eight sale. She does tables mainly. Okay, okay, gotcha. I see Scylla. Oddly enough, in high school, that was the thing I used to do. Was I used to order stuff online, like, uh, and hook people up. And it mostly was anime DVDs. <laughs> And it mostly ended up being bootleg anime DVDs. I did that for a while for money. People would be like, hey, order order this for me. And I was like, sure, done. And order it, and I'd like tack on my like charge for purchasing it. Yeah, it was a long time ago, but it was like, you know, the thing was, was so many people didn't have access to like buying online that like the fact that I did gave me like leverage. <laughs> That was a very long time ago. That was like I was in like grade eleven and twelve when I was doing that, and like I made pretty good money from it. But it was something that like I had one or two bad run-ins doing that, and the one or two bad run-ins. And the thing is, is ninety-five percent of the like uh, sales I made, um, like I told people beforehand, I'm like I can't guarantee if this is like the legit like. DVDs or a bootleg or what, but like, this is like the price is running at, and people would be like, yes or no. And you know, most of the time, most people didn't care. They were just like, yeah, like, I can't get this anywhere. Because this was back in when Tro had like nothing as far as like related to like being able to get like anime DVDs. So, um, no, that was a long time ago. But no, I had one or two bad run ins, and that was what caused me to stop. One which involved, like, paying a lot of money out of my own pocket to, like, make up for an order that didn't end up, like, showing up. And the other one which was just, like, I was like, oh, I should definitely not be, like, working, <laughs> taking jobs for this person. <laughs> okay, how much experience do we got here? Uh, an okay amount. You know what? I might search around uh, the outskirts a little bit more. I feel like there's stuff that I could probably find here, maybe, that would be, like, good to look into. I mean, like, there might even be, like, other bosses here that I was didn't find, so. Let's just explore around uh, Ashina for a little bit. But that uh, was a long time ago. I mean, like, I was only a high school student, so, you know, that was, like, essentially... You know, I want to make some money and buy some video games. <laughs> hmm. Jeez, I'm super hungry. I wish McDonald's down the road was open. Then I would go out for McDonald's. If there's one thing I crave, like, at night, <laughs> it's fries. <laughs> I want fries so badly. Fries and pizza. Pizza is really good too. Whoa, oh, hello. Like, there might be more mid-bosses around here now that I should be, like, taking into... In, ooh. That's... Those are two guys. I'm trying to think of how I can, like, get around here. I think that basically means I'm gonna fight them both. Or am I? I got a plan. This is a ridiculous plan, but it's... It might just work. I don't know. Anime night should be fun, though. Should be something. Literally have a million of these. It's time to use one. Really? Really, guys? Not even, like, a little bit? 
You can't jump and throw them. What good? What good are these ceramic shards if I can't jump and throw them? Well, I got the attention of one, which is kind of what I was going for, anyways. So I guess it kind of worked out. Oh my god! Oh my goodness! Oh jeez, jeez, jeez! I'm gonna let one walk by me and then backstab the other one. <laughs> oh shit, just blocking the doorway now. There we go. Surprise! Hmm, nothing cool in here, I guess. Is that an item? It is an item. An anti scrap. Okay. Hmm. Anyway, so what's people up to? What's what's new? What's happening? Hey, oh, yeah, Keed, we'll have to play Risk of Rain sometime. It's really good. <laughs> I never explored this pond for fish. I just realized. Or items. What the fuck? Oh shit! We have a headless guy down here. We found another boss. Found another mid boss, just like that. So procrastinating. Cause yeah, Risk of Rain 2, really good. Like right out of the gate, it was like, oh jeez, this is this is really solid. Okay, so put on our fear gourd. Our confetti. I've already died once, so I probably shouldn't do this, but actually I have to swim up, because Actually, let's just go to the checkpoint so that um at least I know that my heals are good and everything is like in order. Tried it once, this game was having none of it, no <laughs> really. Honestly, it's been a while since I've played a game that like the three D version is absolutely true to the two D version. <laughs> this is exactly what it feels like. It feels identical to the two D game. Oh, oh my goodness. Oh, I missed it. I got the timing for the Parry though, like last frame probably. There we go. Vacuum that up. Uh, this should on paper be like easy, an easy one to do, but we'll see. Give her some sort of divine confetti, and oh, want to go underwater. Oh, right there. That's where it is. Oh, shit. Oh, come here, grab. Oh, shit. Just like, it's a vortex. strong underwater. There we go. Oh, okay. Well, we found another one and took it out. Hellas. Reduces vitality damage taken from physical attacks. Okay. They all give, like, essentially, like, spells that just give you different buffs, so... <laughs> armored core fights. They do not look like armored core fights. I guess... 
Um, I guess, like, maybe, like... <laughs> I'm trying to think of an armored core game that has a fight, like, like this. Because, like, the first thing I thought of was, was like, new armored core, which drives me wild. Because, like, new armored core is literally, like, trying to aim at things that's, like, in the very corner of your eye, but you're never allowed to see it in the center of your vision. <laughs> it is, it is... Oh man, I record. What the hell? The point Div 2 where gear score matters. Endlessly min-maxing ahoy. Gotcha. Well, I mean, like, that's something. I mean, the recent trend in video games seems to be that, like, gear doesn't matter at all, so... I mean, like, that's something that, like, I can get behind. There's, like, definitely layers of, uh... Like, there's, there's, like, games I like where it's just, like, a lot of time it's just, that's what you spend your time doing is min-maxing. You know what the underwater battles actually feel like, though? They feel exactly like the underwater fights in Monster Hunter. A little bit faster pace, but, yeah. Sorry, buddy. Oh, man. I was having a conversation with uh, GF yesterday about <laughs> Armored Core. New Armored Core definitely ain't my, ain't my thing. I think, I think what makes me bitter about Armored Core is the fact that I liked Armored Core until, like, 4. 4, like, the changes they introduced were, like... Oh, oh, they're shooting at me or something. Um, the changes they introduced to me, like, were just, like, I mean, like, I couldn't play the game, <laughs> so it was, like, ugh, god damn, can't get a beat on where these monkeys are, it's just, like, hide inside this door, bring them up out of the grass so I can see them easier. Oh my god, there, good. some health back. Put back on the fire one. We can get rid of that. Oh, dogs and monkeys fighting. Oh shit. Oh shit, shit. Ooh, this is a lot of monkeys. And also, these ones are very, very scary, so. Oh shit. Oh, we might not make it out of here. I think it's time to ninja pale. <laughs> Literally, like, dual sword monkeys. Incredibly hard. One of the hardest enemies in the game, in my opinion. <laughs> they're mobile, they're fast, they do a ton of posture damage. They're very hard to fight. I don't even think I could fight two of them at once. And I say that knowing damn well that I fought, the <laughs> fought two of the guardian apes at once. So it's like... This is like, that's just a lot, I think. I like this little hill. This is a good hill. Let's like, take it. And let's be really, really stealthy. I'm 
aimlessly just to reactivate this idol. I don't know if there's like anything here. Like I feel like I feel like there's supposed maybe not supposed to be, but Oh, wow. Time to, time to bail. Oh my god. No, 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 no! Oh, it was so close! Oh, dang. Oh, time to, <laughs> time to bail on that. Oh my goodness. Why am I, like, even putting the effort in to fight these monkeys? Oh, my jeez! Ah, jeez! There was just, like, a single monkey down here. We don't want to go up too far there, because the boat's too close to all the monkeys. Dang, my fireworks didn't do anything. Are you kidding me? Yeah, I fucking deserve to die. <laughs> Unbelievable. Took a swing, completely missed, and it was right next to me. Damn you, staircase! <sighs> Anyways, so... Hmm, I think it's probably getting... Getting there. It's probably time to call it soon. <laughs> I think it's pretty low energy tonight. <laughs> I mean, at this point. Oh god, I'm not reaching the thing. No, my ninja knees! I should probably try the Demon of Hatred a couple more times. What do we got? Yeah, let's, let's do it. Give this a shot. Hey, the undying. Hmm. Didn't you like say something about that cooch like the other day? <laughs> hmm. Okay, get our good shield out. Uh, there's a carrot, there's an NPC in, in handbag.
Whoa, wow. That was a fast reaction. Usually it jumps away first. Yeah, dodging the foot there actually seems a lot better. It seems a lot better than, like, blocking it. Bad thing to block. Oh wow, those seem just worse than uh, than the butterfly kunai. Oh shit, that's right too. I put my fucking skill on, and that's what I get. I deserve that. No itchy I should have some reason to keep attacking him, but I can't think of what it is, so I probably shouldn't. Posture break. I think that's why I got like stuck there. Another revive apparently. I guess I can use it. I don't think it's good. Whoa, shit, these things get stuck in trees. That's good information. <laughs> nice driving. Jeez. Dang. I was able to run it one of the one of those instances, but it was probably probably a spacing thing. It was probably more because I was um, farther out. There's like so many layers sometimes that consider like how a move is or isn't punishable. Or like even how a move is or isn't answered. Dang, I was lost. A lot of experience to lose. I guess it's okay. Let's give this another shot. Tracking. Ah, oh, shit. Mm. Too early to be concerned. Oh, that has an actual fucking attack to it. I didn't even know that. It's never hit me. <laughs> fucking hell. <laughs> oh, man. I just fucking let that one, like, rock. Because it's just like, Jesus Christ. Are you fucking kidding me?
Oh my god. Okay. Let's try this again. Nope, not that time. Just take a quick look. Uh, increase the vitality and posture damage for a time. Consume spirit. Uh, this might be useful for us because we, when we do do damage, we do do damage. Ah, oh, fuck. Yeah, double, whatever. You know what? I shouldn't be doing that. I should be reviving and, if nothing else, running to the thing. I mean, yeah. <laughs> exactly. It's not an incorrect statement. <laughs> there we go. Oh shit, the tracking. It's a tricky thing in this game because, like, unlike Bloodborne, like, there is a lot of tracking on moves. I mean, like, Bloodborne has, like, a fair amount, but it's, like, it's not tracking in the way it is, like, this game. This is so itchy right now. scary there for a second. So that leaves us with four heals. Which is like two per <laughs> oh, two for the next two lot stock. Killed me. Jeez. Rude. I'm glad my fire umbrella. Oh shit. Oh my god. Wow. Okay. <laughs> oh my goodness. The tracking. Holy shit. Jesus. This is really hard. 
Like, the umbrella's like a good answer. It only blocks three, though. <laughs> or rather, it only blocks a couple of them. I, wonder, I could probably, like, open and shut the umbrella, like, to parry them, kind of. Ah, oh, shit. Fucking tracking. Unbelievable. Time to heal. Okay. Oop, knocked him out of it. Ow! Whoa! Why was that so deep? Oh, Oof, that was really close. Oh shit, the tracking. Oh fuck, the tracking. <laughs> Oh, shit! Okay, a little bit different this time. Oh, oh, shit, there's, like, fucking just fire. We're in a ring of fire. Great. Whoa, 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 okay. Jesus, this form is a little bit different.
Ooh, wow. Oh my goodness. Whoa! Oh my god. I can't see. Fuck. Ugh. God damn, camera. Uh, we gotta get out of this corner. Oh, whoa. 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 Ah, oh, fuck, 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 fuck. I'm gonna do a thing here. thinking what I want to do. We're gonna use... We're gonna use a Buddha, because we're pretty close on this. We're gonna use a Buddha, and we're gonna use... I don't know if I even have anything. That's the rice, which... Fuck. Uh. Oh. Oh. oh my goodness, I've never been in this situation before with this guy. Oh, wow. Woo. Oh my goodness. We did it! <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> hey, we got a lapis! We got two from that?! Oh my god! <laughs> Holy shit. Finally! <laughs> Jeez. <laughs> Thank you. Thank you, Cooch. Huh. I'm like, fucking still on fire from it. Thank you. Thank you, Panda. Oh my goodness. That was that was intense. No, uh not that. This. Whew. That was that was really, really intense. Oh my god. 
Okay, I think where we're going to go is we're going to cap off this skill point at the garden or the fountainhead and I don't even know what we're doing from this point forward. I guess I guess we'll just kind of call it. <laughs> I think I mean it's 2 a.m. I'm pretty tired, so ah, uh, that one was that was scary. Hey, took out the third form though for the first time I saw it, so I did have to like use a baby revival Buddha, but you know th that's okay. Yeah, I've been streaming since 7 p.m., so we are on six six hours and 40 minutes. Ah, oh, gosh dang. That's 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 a pretty long stream to be fair. Whoa. Okay, we are getting electrocuted. Oddly enough, I think still didn't take as long as what uh what like Ludwig took. <laughs> but it's still pretty pretty scary. Where the fuck is Nightbot? Nightbot Nightbot's running. What do you want from Nightbot? Oh, uptime? I don't have uptime as a command. I don't know why. I'll make it a command, I guess. I think it might be under something else. You just... Uh... What? What the fuck? What was that? That was really weird. bit more. Is it commands? Uh, here, let me take a look. Do I not have uptime? I don't have uptime. You're right. I will fix that. Gotcha. I see. They're also they're also fish people. So that's that's also I I don't know if, I don't think that's historically accurate, but Whoa! Right there, you see what that was? That was like wild tracking. That is how this game do. <laughs> You ain't, you ain't just like, jumping out of the way. There we go. We have three skill points. This literally might be the best spot in the game to like, grind, honestly. It's, it's so good. Like, it's so profitable. I have three skill points, which I could put into... We need five for that. We need three for this. Need five for this. Six six for Shadow Rush apparently. Oh, right, Shadow Rush is this one. Um I'm kind of tempted to put it into this just so I can have like the final one of this like the final thing on this page unlocked. Also the move doesn't sound terrible because apparently it like answers sweeps, which is pretty good, and also anti airs, which it's like that sounds like a good combination. If that was in a fighting game I think I'd like it. Yeah, I'll think on it a little bit. Let me go back to the dilapidated temple. I think this is probably it for the night anyways, so. But, yeah, no. Like, six hours. I mean, I wasn't fighting that thing for six hours, fortunately. <laughs> I was only fighting it for a couple. Um... Okay, so... Let me see. How do I add commands.
commands, custom, uh, add command, uptime, and I forget how to put the command in. Let me think. Um, sorry, I know this isn't the most interesting thing to listen to while I'm like, dang, uh, what was it? Search our help documents. No. Add command. There we go, command variables. And we want time. Current selected time to user. Twitch uh, profile. Count up. Time left from a specific. Hmm. I might have to actually figure this out. I don't think I have it in me right now to figure it out. <laughs> I'll figure it out next time. <laughs> so let's take a look. Can we make another another tool? The only thing we're missing is money, so we can actually make a second second uh, uh, lazulite tool. Probably the best one might be the Sabi Maru. Sabi Maru is really good. That's a like sacred film still probably a good option to have. I just need money for it, but I'm not going to worry about that right now. Anyways, I think I'm going to call it probably for now. Um, be the demon of hatred or whatever, so that is probably a good day's work. Yeah, that's right. Went up in flames. I love it. <laughs> Jeez. Whatever these other two bosses are, not very many people have beaten them. That's concerning. I I haven't at it yet, because I don't know how to program up time yet. It's apparently not a default thing. Like you can't just like you have to actually program the thing, I think. Actually maybe it is a default. Maybe that's why I don't know what I'm doing. Uh, default. Nope, it's not one of the defaults. Womp womp. Well, I'll figure out up time tomorrow. I'm too tired. Thank you, thank you, Cooch. Anyways, I'm gonna call it because I'm super tired. And as far as streaming tomorrow goes, um, I'm gonna be out tomorrow night, so probably no stream tomorrow. At least the earlier portion of the night, just depends on when I get home. But I imagine I'll probably be out pretty late. Uh, I might stream tomorrow afternoon, though, so that might be a thing. We'll have to see what's what, I guess. Anyways, thank you guys for watching. Yes, have a good night, Scylla. Have a good night, Cooge. Thank you guys for watching and hanging out, and everybody have a good night.